Okay, so um, looking for attempted, not yet learned. A question uh, that I see here is interconversion. Where am I here? Interconversion of prefixed and base SI units. So I click on that. I've already prepared my whiteboard for that. So here's what we got. Interconversion of prefixed and base SI units. An optician measures the diameter of her, pup of her patient's pupil. The diameter is 0 0.0041 meters. What is the diameter in millimeters? Okay, that's the question right there. All right, so I gotta change my view here. Uh, what's the diameter in millimeters? All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna look up, and you, you can't see it here, but there's a little, um, when you're doing these problems, there's a data sheet over here, and you click on that and it opens up. The very top one says SI prefixes. And so we know that, that little, little m means 10 to the minus 3. So in other words, 1 millimeter, watch this, is equal to 1 millimeter. All right? You might want to pause the video and do that again. I don't know. I mean, it's, it's uh, these two things. Let me change colors here for a second. These two things mean the same thing okay and of course one means the same as one and meters means the same as meters so that's why this is true a milli is the same thing as that all right so that said we now know uh, how we can do our conversion we need to bring millimeters in here right because it's here and we need to get rid of meters because it's here and we want to cross it off right so now that we know that we can simply put these numbers in here 1 times 10 to the minus 3 is equal to 1 millimeter. All right. Equivalently, I'm going to do the same problem in green here below. Same problem. I'm going to say 10 to the third millimeters. Right. This is exactly the same problem and the same solution. All right, so it looks like what's, what we're going to do is we're going to take this, we're going to take this, I'm going to go back to my red up here, and we're going to move this because it's a big number, right? 10 to the 3, and, or divided by a, a small number, it's going to give you a big number up here. We're going to move it 1, 2, 3 places. So it turns out to be 4.1 millimeters. All right, I hope that's helpful.